more beautiful after knowing how to clean your face properly. Have you applied how to clean your face properly, yet? Don't get this wrong, okay? By taking the right steps to clean your face, your skin will look cleaner and free from problems. Cleaning your face is one of the important steps to create healthy facial skin. This habit can prevent the appearance of acne, overcome dull skin, and prevent premature aging. However, in fact there are still many people who underestimate it and do it the wrong way, for example rubbing their face too roughly or drying their face carelessly. Here's how to clean the right face. So that you can look beautiful with clean and healthy skin, pay close attention and do the following ways to clean your face. 1. Use makeup remover. Do you think that washing your face with soap is enough to make your face clean? If the answer is yes, then you are wrong. Apart from using facial cleansing soap, when you are using makeup or makeup, you also need to clean your face with the double cleansing method. When doing this method, you need to use makeup remover first before washing your face with soap. This technique is known to be more effective in removing dirt and remnants of dead skin on the surface of the skin and pores. There are many types of makeup remover that you can choose according to your skin type, such as micellar water, milk cleanser, and cleansing balm. You can also use olive oil to remove excess makeup. 2. Use the right facial cleanser. Choose and use facial cleansing products with gentle formulas, which do not contain alcohol and fragrances. This product is suitable for all skin types especially sensitive and dry skin. If your skin is oily or has acne, you can also choose products that contain salicylic acid. In addition, avoid using soap that is not specifically for the face because it can change the skin's pH balance. 3. Wash your face gently. Instead of making your face clean, scrubbing your face too roughly can actually damage the outer layer of the skin. Especially if you do it for a long time, it can interfere with sebum production, make the skin dry, and trigger irritation. So, if you wash your face, just rub it gently, okay? It doesn't take long either, just 30 seconds. You can use cold water or warm water to rinse your face. However, don't use hot water, because it can dry out your facial skin. 4. Dry your face. Letting water dry by itself after washing your face is not a good habit, you know. Water that is left on the surface of the skin can evaporate and actually make the skin drier. Therefore, after washing your face, you should dry it using a clean towel or tissue. Do a patting motion and don't rub it, okay? Also avoid using hand drying towels that hang over the sink, okay? Even though it looks clean there is still a lot of bacteria attached. 5. Avoid washing your face too often. The technique for washing her face is correct, but if you do it too much it's a lie. Frequently washing your face can actually make your skin drier. This also applies to facial exfoliation, yes. Wa washing your face is enough in the morning and at night before going to bed, and when you sweat. For exfoliation, you can do it several times a week or consult your doctor beforehand to determine an exfoliation schedule according to your needs and skin condition. After cleaning your face, don't forget to apply moisturizer evenly to your facial skin. This step is important to lock in the moisture of the skin that has just been cleaned. After that, you can continue with other skin care stages, such as serum, essence, or sun cream. If you have eczema, rosacea, 
or other skin problems, you should consult a doctor to get advice on how to clean your face according to your health condition.